American Health Watch tonight. Scientists have discovered some people spread the coronavirus more than others. Local 5's Connie Feldman shows us what makes someone a COVID super spreader. The COVID vaccine is rolling out across the country, but medical experts say this is not the time to let our guards down. Now, scientists have uncovered some of the factors that may make one person more likely to spread the virus than another. From rocket propulsion to sneeze propulsion, these mechanical engineers are adapting their skills in the fight against COVID. Fluid properties drive how well things turn into aerosols. In their study, researchers used computer generated models with intricate geometry to numerically simulate different sneezes. A sneeze is very complicated. So, what makes you a super spreader? It turns out age and gender. Young men are the most likely to spread COVID because of their thin saliva that can linger in the air. Also, a full set of teeth can actually cause sneezes to go much farther. You can think of this in the context of a hose, a garden hose, and if you stick your thumb over it, it leads a spray that goes out much further than without. Congestion can also cause sneezes to increase in velocity. The study showed that sneezes with a full set of teeth and a stuffed up nose went 60% farther than other models. We're doing this study primarily so that we could engineer this, this saliva alteration mechanism. The data suggests that new saliva thickening candy combined with a face mask could reduce or even eliminate the need for social distancing while we all wait for the vaccine. Now that researchers understand the different ways that our bodies can spread COVID, we know what needs to be changed to slow the spread of the virus. The next step is teaming up with an independent company to mass produce the saliva altering candy. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Connie Fellman, Local 5 News. Interesting.